And we've got a match that will mix up sizes. A big man and a little man on each side of a tag team. A midget and a giant on each side of the ring. And this not only offers a lot of opportunity for variety in wrestling, it can sure be exciting, and we expect that it will be. And we hope that you are enjoying our series of the best of Texas wrestling and want to get at it as quickly as we do. Up in the ring, Boyd Pierce, ready to introduce this event to you, and we will pick him up. This special event, a big man and little man on each team, the all-Japanese team of Torquemata and Little Tokyo. Their opponents, the popular duo of Tiger Conway Jr. and Coconut Willie. Your referee, Danny McShane. So here we are now with a big man midget tag team event as the special event of your portion of Houston wrestling tonight. Tiger Conway Jr. and Coconut Willie on one side. And in the opposite corner, surely a pair of opposites with uh, Big Tor Kamata and Little Tokyo. So it's going to be started by the midgets. This doesn't mean that they're going to stay in there long. It just means that that's the strategy. And Coconut Willie that time moved over close to Tor Kamata, but he knew where he was in that ring and he wasn't making any mistake or taking any chances. Side headlock now for Coconut Willie, and he's trying to avoid being pushed into the corner where Tor Kamata was waiting. <laughs> Kamata caught a wallop in the midsection that time, and now on the outside of the ring over here, is Coconut Willie imitating Big Tor Kamata. I tell you, this youngster is sharp. He's got a great sense of humor and a great zest for living. This young Coconut Willie. <laughs> Kamata is being bugged by, by Willie. Watch him, watch him. He's coming in. <laughs> uh, uh, come out of him says <laughs> says Dark Kamada. <laughs> That's a language that Coconut Willie would understand. How's somebody you? Huh? So it's Tiger Conway locked in the grip with Tor Kamada. Side headlock is the hold. And Coconut Willie wants a little opportunity to do something. And I... <laughs> Foot race, and I think Kamada's going to lose. <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you, Coco Coconut Willie went under the ring, and Kamada wasn't about to go under that ring. You see Coconut Willie, he's just just about, his head just about comes up to the, to the top of the ring. So Tiger comes in and he's beckoning to Little Tokyo to try it. Outside it's all Coconut Willie. Kamada's got a plan, and the two Japanese now are trying to put it into execution. I think they're trying to straighten things out, but he's not sure yet. There it is. Now, plan A is going to supplant plan B, but it just depends what happens when they go after each other. <clears throat> Full Nelson for Tor Kamada. And little Tokyo, who never gets anything right, <laughs> drove his fist into the stomach of Tor Kamada and hurt his arm. <laughs> Coconut Willie has an idea. 
Keep your eye on that corner because Willie is never still very long when he's on the outside of the ring. The Tiger with the side headlock. There's temptation. <laughs> That's what you call sharp shooting. <laughs> he hit it right on top of the head. <laughs> Tiger is trying to convince little Tokyo how to go back to the dressing room. <laughs> and I think he did. In the meantime, his partner is having problems. So here comes the Conway clan back in. Little Tokyo is halfway up the aisle to the dressing room. Twisting arm lock for Tiger Conway Jr. And off in the audience, Coconut Willie formed a reception committee for Little Tokyo and belted him with a headbutt. Look at the size of that guy. Notice how with the ease with which he manages to and get up into that ring. Five minutes have gone by. This is a one fall match. And <laughs> 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 he's, he's using talk about it for, for, for a bridge. Whoa! They're bouncing around us here at Drinkside, and I, I want to tell you, we ought to crawl in the trenches. <laughs> but that, that meteor that just went by was Coconut Willie. So Willie and Little Tokyo in the ring to handle their own share of this action. So Tokyo now trying to work over Coconut Willie and he's getting help. Conway's in the ring. That means that Danny B. Chain's torn between two different duties, but the, I think now that with uh, little Tokyo out of there, we may have this resolved. But there, there unfortunately, is Coconut Willie on the, on the canvas. Best chance that little Tokyo has had. Here come the fans now with their rhythmic applause and in their encouragement for Coconut Willie. And the Hawaiian boy is catching it. He needs the encouragement. But when people encourage him, he knows what to do. Oh, I tell you, he can bounce around and use that body of his with tremendous ability. Back body drop and Coconut Willie's on top. There's one. Just one. And Tokyo just got disoriented and went to the wrong corner. Willie now trying to watch out his Torquemada. And that will do little Tokyo no good. Such commiseration is difficult to see. <laughs> Manny slid into second that time, and Coconut Willie, <laughs> he ended up for about row five. <laughs> He's back again. It doesn't take him long to get him down the aisles, but he has put this match into the aisles and every place else that he can find. It. He is apologizing all over the place and leaving little Tokyo in there. So Hawaii's 
Coconut Willie turns to get after the Little Tokyo. Side headlock. He's finding his mark. And... <laughs> well... <laughs> Coconut Willie went out of that ring so fast he slid along the <laughs> along the floor. He can slide on this. I'll tell you, this is highly polished wood. And uh, the <laughs> I've seen I've seen Nick Kozak stop people with the with pointing up to the ring lights, but that's the first one I've ever seen pointing down to the canvas. But I guess with midgets it works even better. <laughs> All right, plan A, Little Tokyo. And everything seems to be all set for this pair. And... <laughs> oh. Ten, minutes. Ten minutes have gone by, and Little Little Tokyo has missed again. But it's Tor Kamada in with Tiger Conway Jr. I tell you, Kai, Tiger's a great guy to have in this kind of match. He, he sets things up for his partner, whether his partner is a girl wrestler or a midget wrestler. If it's a mixed match, he's in it. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I tell you, there was no problem with finding enough to fight as far as Tor Kamada is concerned. <laughs> Tiger with a side headlock. Uh, he's laying that broad fist of his in on the Japanese. Oh, and he and he made Tarkamata glad to get out of there. It's Coconut Willie and Little Tokyo. Uh, he hit and hit hard. There's a quick switch. <laughs> Tokyo, Tokyo's on top. <laughs> but Willie better watch out. And there's still a match going on in there as Torquemada changed his mind about getting into it. Hot exchange between Willie and, and Tokyo. Oh, man. There is a quick sunset flip. He may have him. And he had him because Tiger Conway was able to get around there and put a stop to, to it. And the winners are Coconut Willie and the Tiger of the match, Conway 12 minutes, Jr. 11 seconds, Tiger Conway Jr. and Coconut Willie. I'll tell you, I, never, I don't believe I've ever said any wrestler was real lovable and cute before, but I'm going to tell you right now that Coconut Willie and wait, we've got Tar Kamada and um, well, there is Coconut Willie lifting up the 240 pounds of Tiger Conway and oh no, the match is over, but don't go away because Little Tokyo is try, trying to con. Convince him what he should do. I guess we've got to change. Uh, Tokyo has decided that he can't do anything about it. Hey. Hey. On our side, we saw it, and the match may be over, but so far nobody has done anything that would indicate it. And at last, there is the traditional Japanese bowing, and they're trying to irritate 
Kamada on the on the outside. Look at the staring as Kamada looks in that ring and gets his fingers stomped by Coconut <laughs> Willie. The winners! We'll be back here in a moment after we have this word from the studio.